After getting its own spotlight in the world stage, the Philippine women's national basketball team thinks it's time for Perla's Pilipinas to be included in the Philippine delegation to the 2018 Asian Games. Well, we're hoping that they could finally notice us and give us a chance and maybe get us into the Asian Games in the last minute," said head coach Pat Aquino in Filipino Sunday at Philippine Arena after Perla's loss to Hungary, 18-15, in the group stage. The Samhang Basketball NG Piapinas elected to just send the TNT core with Andre Blatch and select Hila's cadets to the men's basketball tournament in Indonesia with the women's team excluded from the Philippine delegation. You never know, well they say what we did here was an eye-opener, and maybe there will be call from SBP let's include the women's team," added Aquino. But that's just hoping. Despite going 0-4 in the group stage and failing to advance to the quarterfinals, Perlas, which was formed a few months before the tournament, had its moments against much experienced teams. Afril Bernardino was the first to show up for the Philippines in a 12-10 loss to Germany. Then, it was the Janine Pontejo's show in the Philippines' last two games. She hit five long balls for 13 points in a 21-17 loss to Spain. The crowd gave me the energy, and every time I made a shot they would all scream, and of course when that happens my defense also improves," said Pontejos in Filipino. Aquino added other teams from outside the country have shown interest in his players, and he hopes the officials here in the Philippines could also follow suit. Bernardino, Gemma Miranda, and Eliana Lim played as imports in Malaysia a few months before the 3 times 3 World Cup, and the three are set to return for another run. Apart from her Malaysia stint, Bernardino also received an offer from a university team in Taiwan to not only play there, but also study for a graduate degree. Afril could stay there, study and play there professionally, said Aquino. This is also for the future of Afril, so I'm hoping more can be invited because Perlas can't just play here in the Philippines but also outside.